Hi friends, it's Auntie Cuckoo here. Welcome back everyone. So I just have to head into Walmart and you know I'm going to invite you guys to come along with me. Let's go see if they've gotten anything fun in and let's go shopping. So guys, I don't know if this stuff is new, but it looks like they just put out this Pioneer Woman printed pot with a lid. It's 1972. They have the matching tea kettle. It looks like she has a bunch of single pans in the teal. This is a 12 inch frying pan. And it's got the matching um, handle. This one's the 10 inch and then this one's a set of the 11 and the 9 inch and that one is 29. They've got it also in the red and it has that speckle look on all of them like the camping stuff. They do sell the single of this red and this one is not speckled. Let's see, this is a 12 inch skillet. It is speckled. She has the cast iron for $24.88. That is super heavy and she has her little emblem on it. Oh my gosh, I can't. <laughs> Looks like she has a smaller one up here for $19.88. And then there's a few sets of pots and pans. So she has the red one and you get this whole set with the cast iron for $89. Looks like they have it in blue with lids and you get the cast iron. Looks like she did a white set. Oh, this one is silver. Maybe it comes in white and silver. And this one's 129. You get everything there. So I have not seen those and then I'm gonna swing around here because I have not seen this set of salt and pepper shakers and I've never seen her in person her little doggy salt and pepper it looks like they have the coasters and I think those are on clearance so these must not be new I just haven't seen them in person got her little spoons definitely pulling it in for the holiday so I think this is her new fall print called willow this is the round tablecloth I don't see an actual Price. They're clearancing out this pattern for $7. And then they have a few different of the napkins and placemats that we've seen before, but I did not see anything else. Oh, here we go. Here's another one on clearance the teal and white check. So that's about 50% off. It was $13.97, but I think this is her new. Print. Seeing Purple. some new dish print stuff from Re. So they've got the little drying mats over here. They've got these dish towels, which I've never seen in these patterns. This is a four set, and you get them for $10.88. What is this? Scalloped edge. This doesn't have a scalloped edge. They do have the set that I think is beautiful with the flowers. You get a tea towel and a dish towel. And I'm guessing this is her fall collection here. It's much darker. And you get a tea towel and a dish towel. So they do have this set of Re Drummond Dandelion pot holders for $1.50, you guys. They also have the set of two of the dish towels. One's a dish towel, that one's a dish towel. This is the tea towel for $1.50. And I have not seen this one in the dish towel and tea set. It's really, really beautiful. But these are the only patterns. It's the blue and teal that are actually on clearance. She has a couple others that are not. But as you can see, this one back there is $3. If I said $150, I'm sorry. I was thinking of that. All right, so they have a lot of end caps with the Pioneer Woman stuff on it. This one comes with um, like a 9 by 13, a little glass bowl, and the little 8 by 8. This one is $26.68. They did 
put out a set of measuring spoons. I do not see the price on these. All right, they put out a display of her sets of dishes. These say that they were $44.92 and they're down to $39.86. So we've seen that one and the blue. I've never seen the red out of the box. It is really red. It is a really bright, beautiful red. Now the plates don't match the bowl to me, to me. And then they have a couple sets of the cream down there. So I thought I'd take you guys down this aisle. Looks like there's a few things on clearance from Pioneer Woman. The mason packs of four. And it looks like they're supposed to have lids and straws. They've got this real pretty glassware. These are not my colors, but I'm very fond of them. I think they're very, very pretty. They had them in clear, but these are the ones on clearance. And then I had not seen, I don't know if this is a, no. Here, here's a Pioneer Woman thing, just kidding. I think this belonged back in Halloween. Um, I had not seen these before. So let's see what it says. Simply homemade garden. And they're very, very big drink containers with straws trying to see if I can see the ounces for you guys. There we go, it's 32 ounces, teal mason jar with lid and straw. So that one's got the floral. That one's got a green polka dot and the jar on this one's actually like a purpley color. Not as dark as this stuff though. And then there's a red lid back here on a purple one. So I don't know what that's about, but those were new. And then they have the four packs um, and these are 10. So some of them that are old are on clearance for seven, but these are the new ones. And so you get the four pack for $9.97. And then they have it also in this, which it's missing some, so I don't know what that's about. Maybe somebody moved a lid over, but these are also teal jars. And these are teal jars too. So yeah, I just wanted to share those with you guys. I had not seen those before. You guys, these are so cute. I found some new placemats at Walmart. This one's a black and white combo really really adorable <clears throat> and then they have this burlap style this is 247 that was 274 this is burlap but it's got like the finished knotted edge and then they have this one that's a little more rustic it's also 274 and it's a square it looks kind of like a rug but oh my gosh those are really cute good job Walmart. it looks like they have the runner too in that pattern i don't see the other oh here we go they do have a burlap one. I really like that black and white. So I found this super cute barn cookie jar. I'd say it's about 18 inches long. It's probably 18 inches tall too, but maybe just 10 inches across the top, and it's $14.88, you guys. That's just a really good price, especially if you do the whole barn stuff. They have this new butter dish. They have it in a few colors. Obviously, that's not the price. Everything was inward places. These were new to me. They're the glass bowls with the plastic covers. I saw red, teal, and gray. I was looking over all the dishes. Everything looked familiar except this cup here. So I don't know if this is a new print. If you guys have seen this before, let me know. It looks Christmassy to me, but it is for 88. It does coordinate with the ones I've seen before. These were definitely new. So these are really big um, canisters or cookie jars. They have it in the clear and the teal and it's 1986. It's really big. It matches those glasses she did. 
So they also did the salt and pepper shakers in the barn, which are super cute and $5.46. That's a really reasonable price, especially if you do the whole farmhouse barn motif. I mean, just for little decorations, they're cute. These all look familiar, but I think these actually coordinate with her crock pot patterns. And I just wanted to do a double take to make sure I didn't miss anything. There's a whole other kiosk we'll get to. Now these salt and pepper shakers of the birdies are definitely new. And she had out other ones. I think the dogs are old. I don't know if these white dogs are new, but those birdies are definitely new. And then I found this empty and then I looked down and found another box. So these are flying off the shelves apparently. They're the little dipping bowls. They're $1.96. She put out six patterns. They're really, really cute. I mean, she did a lot of blues. So this one's like a teal blue, but light and mustard red, and then the more baby blue and the green. And so I looked under and there's one bowl missing. So and I looked again, that one was missing. So the one that I think is popular is that one. It's a darker teal with the roses. We've seen that pattern before. So keep an eye out for those if you're interested. They are $1.96, which I guess two bucks for a tiny little bowl. They're only about two inches. Now these were definitely new. I think these are called utensil caddies or urns or something. Very pretty pattern and the matching paper towel holder. So that one was $11.97. The big crock was $14.82. And then this whole section was back by my electronics. So I had seen all these things in the housewares except for this little shelf and it is little. So it was the only one in my store and it was $39.96. And it's pretty small look those little drawers just fit a couple of k cups and those are not very big it does stand up so i don't think it has to be wall mounted now all this other stuff the um baking dishes and the pots and pans and all this stuff was back in my regular kitchen section but this looked like overflow so i went back over to see if i was missing anything and I'm not sure that any of this here is particularly new. I have seen these in my store for a while, except this, the strainers look like that red one I don't think I've seen. Maybe it's just not made it to my store. And this rolling pin. So it's kind of a fall color, it's burgundy. It's a pretty good price, it's $12.72. These were also fairly new. I think I may have seen them once before. Her wooden utensils, $3.92. Um, this is like a salt and pepper shaker holder, I think. And then this is back in my dishware section. So this is where I originally saw everything. And this looks really familiar. I think she put one out with a butterfly last year. And they're the five quart pots. Um, and she has her sets of dishes. She has the 10 piece and you get the actual cast iron with it. This tray is very heavy. It was hard to shoot. It's 21 inches. It's 1996. And then for $12.72 she has these cute pie pans or ceramic dishes. The red one is really really cute and looks Christmassy around the edges. So I saw it in blue and red. And then again this was the first time I had seen the set of um, casserole dishes or baking dishes and I've seen of course her cake platters now here's a look at the patterns on her crock pots and those match a lot of the new things I'm seeing now this is a different section but it's over by where our kitchen stuff is and just more overflow so I haven't seen any of the bedding but they're really pushing the dishes so this is huge this was a much better way to show it to you guys because it was too heavy to hold with one hand and then back here they had the set of bowls that I had seen that are the mustard and teal and red 
but they also had it in a floral set, which is down here. Sorry, a man stopped me and was trying to give me tips on how to take pictures. And then on the other side, they had the sets of the pots and pans. So I headed back to check out all of the different towels. This one is definitely new. It's kind of a muted color with the burgundy and green, kind of Christmassy. That was the only one that looked new. Everything else was pretty familiar except this, the rug. I don't think I've seen a kitchen rug from her. Now this coordinates with the patterns on the crock pots I'm going to show you guys. So I think that's new as well as this set of four napkins. They're all just different polka dots. They're kind of a linen-y looking background. And then I've seen some of these placemats, but I don't think I saw the top one before. Again, seeing a lot of her floral patterns that coordinate with her crock pots. And then a few runners. And then this is definitely new. I hadn't seen this before. It's a woven placemat, 347. It's really light teal, so I don't know if that's out for Christmas. She had, of course, a few runners and a few tablecloths. And then I was out in the lunch section looking for something for the kids, and she has a whole line of lunchware, which I've seen, but these are new patterns. So they're, they come in circles, different sizes, different prices and rectangles and I had not seen this lunch bag before. It's pretty big. I think it's 1984. I was looking on the tag because the other ones I've seen included a water bottle but they said so on the tag. They had it packaged inside and this one didn't. It reminded me a lot of a diaper bag because it's got this side pocket and it's pretty big. So these are not from Marie, but I thought they were pretty interesting little copper cups. And then we'll go ahead and end it here with a little bit of what I'm seeing in her crock pots. Pretty much just the florals we've seen before. I saw three different versions that I'm showing you here. Thanks so much for shopping with me guys. I'll be back with another video very soon of what I found in the Christmas department. So I'll see you guys soon in the next one.